Hello everybody, Jeremy is here once again to give you another look inside a Loot Crate unboxing. This is going to be our box for April. Uh, the theme this month is Investigate, and I believe that's stuff like X-Files, uh, Batman, Jessica Jones, even Stranger Things I believe. Which, you know, a few of those are pretty good for me. Um, but you know, before we get in this box, let me just, you know, get you up to speed. Um, there's definitely going to be some more uh, Kyoruja stuff coming soon before I get into this box. Uh, but before then, I just want to remind you, Loot Crate, monthly subscription service box, about 20 bucks a month. Depending on which box you get, other boxes are like 30, but they have a lot of different uh, options out there. Clothing options, pet options, gaming, all that different sort of stuff. But, if you would like to get in on this and you would like a discount, 10% discount on your first order, Please use the link in the description below. Not sponsored by Loot Crate, but it's a personal link for me. And if you use it, it helps me out a little bit, and I'd appreciate it. Anyway, let's get into this Investigate box. It is a beautiful day outside, so of course we are in unboxing children's toys and things along those lines. And let us take a look. La da dee, la da da. What is in there? Oh, another Q fig. Okay, you know what? Look at the box, it looks like a uh, suitcase with some investigation stuff in here, so obviously you can fold it to do that. But, I do want to say, Loot Crate has been getting big on the Q-Figs. Um, I'm trying to think, I have a Deadpool one, a Hulk one, a Harley Quinn, Doctor Strange, and now, little Jessica Jones, and this is the version of the Netflix show. Very, very cute, she's kicking down a wall. Love it. You know what? We're going to just pop it open right now. Take a look. Sometimes they have variant versions when they have figures in these. Not always. Um, mine looks pretty normal. So if there is a variant, I'll, I'll look in the, in the uh, pamphlet <coughs> to check. But as is, I'm not seeing anything. It looks like a normal one. But yeah, little Jessica Jones. She's kicking over a wall. Very, very cute. Um, I love Kristen Ritter in this show as Jessica Jones. To me, it's still the best Marvel Netflix show out there. I know some people like Deadpool more. Not Deadpool. Daredevil. Der Daredevil more. Um, Luke Cage is pretty solid too, but Jessica Jones is still my favorite. It's a much more psychological show than it is just the action, and I think that sets us apart from the other ones. Anyway, t-shirt. Um, there's always a t-shirt in the box every month. We'll see what this month's is. It's from Stranger Things. And all, there they are. There he is. There's the entire cast. There's 11. Um, I assume everybody by now has watched Stranger Things. I think it's a fantastic show. Very nice throwback to the 80s. Um, I don't like, you know, I'm not as in love with it as everybody else is, but it is a very good show. Definitely worth your time. Season 2 is coming out later this year. Um, hopefully it can live up to the hype. As far as the shirt goes, I think it's a pretty cool design. Very, like, old retro style. Um... I'm not a huge fan of black t-shirts, but I think it works with this design. I think it's pretty cool. Um, and yeah, digging it. This is definitely another one of my workout shirts. When I'm outside jogging around, I'll be wearing, wearing this bad boy. Next up, ooh, this is heavy. Color changing mug, another Loot Crate exclusive, Batman. All right, let's see what you got here, Batman. Anybody who's watched these videos for a while knows that Batman has never been my favorite character. I think he's a bit of a crybaby, to be honest. Um, but I have lots of friends who love Batman, so if I don't keep this, I know I will have somebody to give it to. Um, alright, so it's a nice black mug, it's got the skyline of Gotham, and I can see it on the side if I hold it at an angle, you probably couldn't see it on the camera, but I'm guessing when you put liquid in it, it turns yellow, because I see a design for the bat signal on the side. So, very nice though, cool mug, very, very awesome. Let me set that to the side. Uh, what else do we have in here? This is just a this is just a random pencil sharpener. That's odd. Is this the extra loot from the keys thing? I don't know. Um, maybe it is. If you don't know what that is, uh, Loot Crate's been starting something for the last month or two where you can use the items that you get and the box itself to go online and solve some puzzles. And if you solve all the puzzles that are available, they said they will give you an extra item in your box the following month. I don't know if this is it, because it's kind of chintzy. Maybe I'm maybe I'm missing something, but we'll, we'll keep going. See if we can figure out that mystery. Mystery, investigate, haha. 
Next up is X-Files Pencil Set. Okay, so um, I never was really a big fan of the X-Files, so I don't really know what this is a reference to, although there's a picture of David Duchovny playing with pencils on it. So I guess that's a thing he would do on the show. Uh, but it's four regular pencils, and they say one says the truth is out there, another one is I want to believe, third one is trust no one, and the fourth one is that's why they put the I in FBI. So let me take a look. I assume they're just regular old pencils, yeah. Yeah, they're just standard pencils, but they each have a little phrase from the show on them. So that's an interesting little exclusive item for Loot Crate. I might be giving this to my brother. I don't know. Because I know he was a fan of the show. Um, next up is the pin. Every month they give you a pin, a little collectible deal. Um, and this month it is a tape recorder, old school tape recorder. You know, for if you're out investigating, you talking to the tape recorder, much like uh, Twin Peaks, I guess would be a good example of that. And there's the bottom of the box with more of the investigate stuff. So again, you turn this inside out, it looks kind of like a little briefcase full of investigation tools. And this, okay, so this right here is, um, hmm. So this is what's used to uh, decode stuff, and you use it to like uh, figure out all the different bonus loot stuff for the month. So, very cool, very fun. And this is our Investigate uh, magazine. Every month they give you a magazine that has articles related to this stuff, and it uh, talks about um, the actual items inside. Let's see. So first off is the uh, Batman mug. Okay, so the sky kind of gets a green fog, like the Joker, I guess. Is do you poison gasoline? I don't know. And there's the bat signal. Uh, looks like the Jessica Jones figure is there's just one version of her. Not a, no variants. Doesn't look like it. Um. Okay. Okay, that makes more sense. Okay, this T-shirt. Not just Stranger Thing, thing blah, 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 Stranger Things, but it is a takeoff of an old X-Men comic. Um, it says it's Uncanny X-Men number 134, which is part of the Dark Phoenix saga. So, so you know, seven is... Seven, God, why am I doing this? Eleven is standing there, you know, with the monster behind her as Jean Grey would stand there with the Phoenix Force behind her. So it's a, it's a nice little uh, homage. X-Files pencils... Do, do, do. Talks about how you can flip the crate, uh, do unlocking the keys stuff, and um, the pins actually tend to help you go online. And, and there's usually like a little bonus content. Um, here it says that it has, with the pin gives you a um, code that allows you to download and read two uh, X Files comic books, two old X Files comic books. So that's cool. And always in the box, um, if you'd like, you can take pictures of yourself with your loot, and sometimes they will post them in here if, if you uh, send them to them on Twitter. So that's a fun little bonus. And then there's always the Mega Crate. Uh, one person every month, they just decide to give this big, massive crate at random, full of lots of stuff. Still following the theme, same franchises, but it's always bigger stuff. Here it is uh, trade paperbacks of Jessica Jones' alias, the complete X Files on Blu ray. Uh, a a uh, Batman Lego set and a uh, custom uh, tabletop gaming tables. Also a cool little fun bonus they have there. So that's nice. And that is going to be it for the month, guys. Um, again, we'll just go over this really quickly. We got our t-shirt. That's a $15, $20 item right there. Mugs, $10, $15 item. Pencils, probably just a couple bucks. And these cute figs are usually a good $10 to $15 too. So you're looking at, you know, 50 bucks probably would be the minimum uh, for what this is worth. And again, you're paying 20 bucks, so you're always getting a good value. And the cool thing with Loot Crate is nowadays is that there's always a theme, like I said with the Investigate, and they tell you the franchises. Like I told you at the beginning of the video, I knew it was going to be Batman, Stranger Things, X-Files, Alias, Jessica Jones. And since I'm always a big fan of Jessica Jones, and I love Stranger Things, and I have friends and family members who love the other two franchises, I'm like, this is going to be a great crate. And I get every crate, but for some people out there, they might not, you know, be as, you know, they might have to uh, save some money. And you might be like, you know what? I don't like this theme this month. It's not a lot of franchises I like. You can just hit a button on their website that skips that month and just go right to the next month. 
So it's really cool um, and you know there's no real huge commitment in that respect if you want to buy from month to month. You can also buy three, six, 12 month subscriptions anyway and that also saves you a little bit of money in that direction. But whatever you want to do, there's a lot of options out there for you again. So please subscribe to Loot Create, use my link below if you'd like to. Um, and that's going to be it for me for right now, guys. Um, I told you at the beginning, uh, Kyoruja stuff is coming up again. Uh, nothing has arrived yet, but there should be some new mecha in the next week or so. So that'll be big. Loot Anime will be coming up. Um, but other than that, it's kind of at a slow time. Um, I got a lot of I'm very busy in my personal life. But I'm still going to try to get these out for you. Um, and I really appreciate you guys watching these. Um, you know... Even a handful of views means a lot to me because it's just a fun project I do on the side. I'm not looking to be some big YouTube superstar. Um, but as always, guys, please like this video if you like it. Comment if you have something to say. Subscribe to this channel. Um, ring that bell if you'd like to be notified of my new videos. And the best thing you can always do for me, as always, is to just share this video. Friends, family members, geeky people that you know, people who enjoy um, delicious beverages in comic book themed uh, ceramics. All those people out there, I am Jeremy, a.k.a. Captain Subbar, saying to you, for now and always until the end of time, I am going to be king of the geeks. Like, like, look at, look at Kristen Ritter. Like, she's looking all, she's looking all fierce. Um, and that's a lot better than she was looking in Breaking Bad, if you know what I'm talking about. Um, I won't tell you what I'm talking about, because some people probably still haven't seen Breaking Bad and would like to. But, you know, she's good in that show, too. Hi!